wanted to do a, a quick video on this uh, canoe pack that I put together that I'll wear um, when I go to the boundary waters. Um, I put it in a, a fanny pack so that I can actually wear it on me, not a backpack, something like that, while I'm sitting in the canoe. That way, if I dump, I'll always have this attached to my, my person. This is a uh, Helicon Tex, uh, I believe it's a Bandicoot fanny pack. It's not real big, but it it's uh, you know small enough to where it's comfortable. I can wear it on my back or, or front, uh, depending on what's more comfortable when I'm sitting. Large enough to fit, I think, everything I would need. So I'll go through it right now. Um, I would have an, a belt knife on me um, also, and whatever's in my pockets, like a lighter or something like that. But anyway, so the, the front pocket, this is also useful for not only like if you dump, but also stuff that you would need on your person while you're canoeing, let's say. So um, the knife of choice would be a, a Leatherman so that I can get the uh, fish hooks out of fish that I catch. Um, the other thing I have in the front is just a head net in case the bugs get bad. So that's stuff that I would need, you know, um, for actual, you know, the canoeing process. So in the middle por portion, I needed some cordage. So I have a quick deploying ridge line. Um, I need that anyway for tarps and stuff in camp. So I just put it in here. And then if I dump, I have some cordage. Um, I have my compass. I would need that anyway to navigate through islands and stuff in the boundary waters. So I have that in there. So I, it's always close by while I'm canoeing. I also have a headlamp. I would need that anyway, but again, when you dump, it would come in handy. I have a, a small fire kit. So this is, in here is an, a lighter. I probably have one in my pocket too. I also have a button compass, some wet fire tinder, uh, chapstick, um, some uh, steel wool, a ferrule rod, and uh, a little bit of paper in the bottom. So I have that in Altoids tin with a uh, Ranger band on it so I can make fire. I have a uh, Life Straw Frontier Pro. I don't know if it's a Life Straw. It's a water purification thing. I can uh, attach the hose right to this and suck right out of the you know whatever water source i have a couple extra wet fire tinders so that gives me like five different wet fire tinders i have a uh lansky diamond rod to sharpen my knife i also have extra batteries for the headlamp i have a uh a signaling mirror in here and also a this is a uh, a uh, magnifying lens but it's just like a card and it works great um, if you have the Sun you can uh, make fire with that very easily it works surprisingly well so that's the main pouch and then in the back I have a little bit extra cordage one of those uh, bracelets uh, paracord bracelet. I have Aquamira, or these are micro pure water pur purification tablets, and a cotton bandana for everything a bandana is used for. Also, char cloth. Um, so, if you get one fire going, then you char some cloth for the next fire. This also has a bunch of useful knots on it, so I thought that was handy type of bandana so I could you know, have knots for the different cordages because I don't know my knots very well. And then in, in here, there's a sleeve where you pass a belt through and I have uh, two drum liners. Um, I th think they're like three mil drum liners. That would be for like a cover, um, pretty much a, a lightweight tarp um, to stay out of the rain and, and uh, keep dry. And then inside of there, I have a couple Ziploc bags for a, uh, a container to get water and I can drop these, these into. Um, you'd have to look at the ounces and how much water, whatever bag you're gonna use, um, 
holds, okay? So you know how much, how many tabs to use in that Ziploc, particular Ziploc bag. So yeah, that's everything. I have a uh, way to keep me dry, um, a cordage to set that up, and anything else you would need cordage for, a knife, um, a way to get water. Um, the only other thing I could think is if you really were thinking you were going to be out there for a really long time, you could put like some snare wire or whatever in here. Um, hopefully that wouldn't be the case. But uh, yeah, it all fits in that pack. So if I was to dump, I would have that on me. And I, I wouldn't be just left with, you know, what I'm wearing and what's in my pockets. So, um, and it's actually, you know, fairly comfortable when you're, when you're paddling. It doesn't interfere with your uh, your life jacket. The only other thing I would add to this is is my inReach Garmin. Um, while I'm paddling, I, I will attach that. There's some molly webbing on the sides just to um, have that on me also. So I have a way to tell somebody I dumped or you know get get a hold of my wife. So anyway, um, maybe that'll help somebody. Uh, get them thinking about that type of thing, um, to have something strapped to your body if you were to dump.